Hello everybody and welcome to Lead Dangerous Streaming here. Just finishing setting up and we're going to start our approach to Waypoint 7 uh, of the of the Gre of the Gre 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 Vale over in Camp Edwards and Waypoint 7 of the Beagle Point Expedition here. Waypoint 8, sorry. Apparently I have to update the stream. So, fortunately, we have another commander out at Waypoint 8 by the name of... Let's see if I get his name back up here, just to make sure I pronounce it right. New, but with no hats, who's hopefully going to... Uh, who I'm going to send a wing invite here to. He is in the system next door where we're going to make an approach to the landing site at Waypoint 8. And do 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 do, which is great because this way it gives us a beacon to land on the planet, and I don't have to spend a whole lot of time looking for those silly coordinates. Speaking of which, uh, if you're not aware of what we're doing exactly here, is that uh, Lead Dangerous, uh, this crazy game has this expedition called the Eagle Point Expedition, woohoo! And they have a whole bunch of crazy waypoints on our way around the galaxy. As you can see here, we are coming up on Waypoint 8 in the Greer, in Greer War, whatever sector. And the place is called the Camp Edmondson, whoever found it. And, and it's in the Greer Vale, which is the name of the nebula or whatever around here. We'll be going to planet B1 at these coordinates, 30, uh, negative 38 by negative 82 here. <coughs> but again, um, we'll be making the uh, main approach by... Uh, our uh, lovely help, noob, with no hats. So, let's see if I can find the map to show you real quick if it's on here on my spreadsheet. wanted to show you the... Oh, it's, yeah, here we go. So here's the route that we're taking. Um, not sure why I can't zoom out, but hey, Google. So there you have it. Uh, we're going in the greens here from the bottom up. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, Greerwar, Greer, Greerroy. I'm never going to say that right. And then, of course, we're moving all the way up here, all the way to Beagle Point. And then, as some of you know, I'm going to try to set the distance from Soul Record by going to Samotus Beacon past Beagle Point and then going out towards the edge of nowhere, past the edge of the galaxy in known space to see if I can get farther than anyone else has in the game from Earth, from Earth's sun anyway. Uh, in particular. Um, and so that that's the direction to do it. And so fortunately, this uh, expedition happened to be going out this way, right up to Beagle Point here. So I thought, you know, I'd jump in with them and see the cool stuff. And uh, yeah. So I take that back over here, get to where I need to be. And we made it all the way up one jump next door. Oh, good, and then we've got, fortunately, we've got Noob with no hats here in our live chat. Hey, what's up, buddy? Thank you for making that easy for me. All right, yeah, let me just, uh, yeah, exactly, make the jump here. Um, I assume I'm next door to it, so there we go. Uh, make sure everything's turned on. It needs to be turned on. Yeah, that's good enough. All right. Yeah, what's up, Ruckus? SRVs and it didn't work. Yeah, no, yeah, well, maybe support for that someday, Ruckus. Um, Ruckus and I were playing the other day, and unfortunately, when you do hollow stuff with other people, although you can fly their fighters, you cannot drive their SUVs, their little, you know, Land Rovers around the planet or some, you know, or any of that. So, that is unfortunate. You always wonder why they let you do the fighters, but not that. What, what's it not doing? Hard gear, scoop up, what now? There, how about that? Oh, come on, really? I don't have the... Huh. Am I not in a... Oh. Huh. Guess I need a neutron boost again.
All right, sorry about that, noob. Watch your fuel. Uh, oh yeah, no, I'm fine. It's um, I have a remarkably uh, uh, that's actually a lot of fuel, a lot. It looks like I'm almost empty, but thank you for noticing. I don't want to fill up too much on fuel because the more fuel you, you have, the more mass you weigh. The more mass you weigh, the not as far of a hyperspace jump you can take. So I keep the fuel low uh, in order to make long jumps. Um, yeah. So making our way back to the neutron star here. I think. Apparently I decided to go 4,000 light seconds out to these planets. I think it's because I was the first to discover them. Yep. Cool thing is, you come up to these planets, you scan them, you see it doesn't have a discovered by. Right over this neutron star, we have a first discovered by Shaden. I'm assuming I'm pronouncing that name right. Hope you're out there, Shaden. Not trying to throw any shade on Shaden. And, uh, but Shaden didn't bother to scan any of these planets like he scanned the, new, or she scanned the neutron star. And, uh, yeah. So I did, and if I ever get to turn in my scan results, they'll say, hey, first discovered by Keep Dro. Yay. And if any of those planets were worth a, a darn, then, um, yeah, then I could, I could pay it, I could some money. Okay, making good progress now. So I'm sure most everyone watching knows uh, if you, unless anyone's watching from Eve that I spammed out there. A few people watching. Oh crap. That e you try to go through the exhaust jets of a neutron star in order for it to essentially boost your fuel efficiency. A little bit of fuel efficiency. AKA jump range. Increase your jump range. So. Although the time it's taken to do this, I could have probably hopped a few stars over and would have been there already and not, oop, had to go through the dangerous crap of, of, uh, of, of, of this. All right, here we go. Noob's being very patient over there with any luck. He's trying to scale a mountain uh, in his SRV. Oh crap, too fast. You gotta spend about six seconds in these exhaust jets. I don't know of any faster or more proper way to do it than that. Six seconds and boom, total, total, and then you're good. So if you just fly through, through it real fast for three seconds, you only need to spend three more seconds in it. All right, now let's get the hell out of here. Over next door. Jump already. Well, I guess it isn't next door so much it is 185 light years away. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. As you see, uh, noob, and anyone else watching, the fuel usage here for this 185 light year jump is just a tiny little speck of yellow. Did I not? Oh, there we go. Come on.
Oh, crap, 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 crap. That's big. All right. Oh, and I need to pipe the sound through, don't I? There is no sound going through here. One second. There we go. How about that? Turn it down a little bit. Okay, noob, let me just scan this Neutron Star to make some money. How many tanks did I bring? Uh, again, I'm trying to set the distance record, noob, so let's just say I'm on. But not to, you know, you got, have to have fun, right? About, you know, double SRD bay and everything. You never know when you or somebody else is going to make you lose one. Oh, shit. You just see that? You see that little ring that just popped That line that just popped up? Is this a, oh, this is a white dwarf. Oh, these are the things I shouldn't be trying to boost off right? These are like the don't bother with because you'll end up getting screwed. Well, here we go. I don't really, because I don't know why, but just to have it later, this is, should last. Hey, there we go, supercharger. Not as much boost as a neutron star, which is why some people just avoid them all together for that reason. Whew, alright, let's get the hell away from it. And time to go see new with no hats. I am a noob, but you know what? I have had. All right, hey, not that far away. Oh, I forgot to do the hunt. There we go. Look at that. All right, while we fly over there, let's see what's in this system. Now that I've scanned it out. All right, as expected, all of these were have been discovered. Because again, this is our meetup system here, and we have lots of landable planets here, um, of which our buddy is on one of uh, these, it would seem. Probably this one. Okay, approaching, approaching, approaching. Ruckus, say something in chat if you're watching it. Alright, wing signal, noob, with no hat. Okay, you're not going to scan this star. Noob, you're not going to mind, right? I always got to scan the star here. Oh. Get a little close. A little crazy. Brown dwarf, or I can't get if I'm not mistaken. Or can we? No, if I'm not mistaken, we can't get any fuel off that star. Um, so back to you. Over here. All right, here we go. Go too fast. All right, we have scanned this planet. Hey, you're on the bright side, it looks like. That's good. Not that it matters because they, you know, silly, silly. Stupidly, this is a stupidly, stupidly light on the dark side of planets anyway. But it looks like that's going to be fixed, hopefully it patches a little bit. Whoa, are you on the other side of this planet? Where'd you go? I don't get it, I don't see you.
Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I think I see it over here. Can't climb the mountain when the wing signal is up, says Noob. Oh, really? Oh. Um. Crap. <laughs> Yeah, if you could if you stop climbing for a second or something, I'm trying to look for you, but I can't see you again. I mean, I see, I guess I see the dot on the radar. And by the way, there's a delay here, probably about 20 seconds in you typing and me talking, responding and everything. Uh, coming around, coming around, coming around. Yeah, I get... I don't... Can you stop? <laughs> Where are you at, Hoss? Oh, oh, oh! Is it because I don't have... Oh, there we go. Okay, awesome, awesome. I got you locked in. Let's see, what's my... Altitude's 200. Alright, I got some. Ooh, 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 ooh. Nothing says you're serious about flying and going sideways. Okay, it is time to decelerate and go down on noob with no hats. Wait, did I say that right? How's the gravity of this planet? I guess I'm about to find out. Seems mild. Seems pretty mild, I'd say. Alright, so noob, I, I suppose, so please don't hit me, I have no shields. Oh, I don't even have guns, man. So I uh, disabled everything to save you. Yeah, no, I, I know what you mean. I've done that before with, uh, with that, too. Um, I think if you want, you can probably go do your own thing, and I can go find my landing coordinates uh, if you want to. Thank you so much. Uh, and then I will hop on the SRV and try to meet you up there. This is fun. Thank you so much. Uh, it's, it's, it's so much easier to know what, you know, just to, just to come right at you on the planet and come down as opposed to spending life. Five ten minutes orbiting the planet until you get to the right coordinates and then come down. And hope you did it right, otherwise you're spending another ten fifteen minutes slowly getting there. Oh shit! What are we doing? Final six k. Oh wait, is that your ship down there? Oh, that is your ship down there. Oh okay, point one eight g or so. Okay, great, thank you. Yeah, I probably should have looked that up before. All right, well, if that is your ship down there, great. Hey, if you want to get back out in SRV around or whatever, uh, cool. I know where I'm coming at now. I will park right next to you. I thought that was your SRV. I was coming down at it first. I was going to go in somewhere. But no, that is your ship. Um, let me turn off my lights. My beacon's on, should be able to see me come in pretty easily. Sorry, I didn't notice that before. Don't worry, as you see here, uh, noob, I'm coming in nice and slow and not mess with you, buddy. Target shields online. Uh oh, your target shields are online. Oh no, he's gonna shoot me, boys. I'm doomed. I'm doomed. Oh, 
where are you going? Landing gear deployed. Oh, Commander, where, or is your just, oh, that's your ship just going off, isn't it? Oh, okay. There you are. Oh, well, damn, dude. I don't blame you if you don't trust me. <laughs> or if you didn't do that and it just automatically did it, but I was going to, you know, not, I was going to take, park next to it, take some pictures. All right, how about right here? Oh, shit. All of this unsuitable. Or did you do me a favor and try to clear a parking space because there ain't dick for parking out here? In which case, you're awesome. But yeah, oopsie, didn't exactly find the meter where you parked that. Either way, I'll find it. Oh, here's something that might be suitable. Come on, give me a little bit of that yellow love. Little yellow love, right here. No? Maybe here. What if I what if I turn the ship this way? Will I get some yellow love? No? Oh damn. Picky picky. No and oh 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 that is a ridiculous parking spot. But it did just give me some yellow love. Maybe we should just avoid it though. That's probably too stupid of a parking spot. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Or or, or not? Come on, come back. Where were you? Oh, noob, I'll never get to park. Wait, what's that over there? Oh, hang on, let me go over here. Let's see some parking. Nope, that's even worse. But this might work. <laughs> no idea. Oh, for heaven's sake. Maybe not. You did do me a favor of moving that ship off the planet, didn't you? Holy cow, what a pain in the ass. Alright. <clears throat> maybe maybe someone's on all that key and finding a great place to land out here. But it is pretty, folks. As far as the veil goes, I suppose I should give you a little bit while we're, before we stop here. Give you a little idea of where we're at. This is where we're at. In the galaxy, the far end there with all the bookmarks over here is where Earth is at. We left Earth to make our way to Colonia to the start of the expedition. Came all the way here to the center of the galaxy. Saw the as you can see in some of the other streams I have on the, on YouTube. Uh, saw the supermassive black hole in the center of the galaxy. Made our way through all these other waypoints and are finally out here. As you see, this is a very we're right beneath this very pretty nebula. That veil right there, I presume. And then we're just south of it. So, here, trying to find damn parking. <laughs> That's where we're at. All the way across the galaxy, still can't find parking. Congratulations. Not even, a, not only on one other person on the planet, no damn parking. Alright, no. But it's cool. I, got, I found some yellow right here. It looks like we got some flat. There we go. Nice and flat. Here we go. So just like you, I've got a little bit of a of shields uh, noob with no hats because, hey, landing is not always perfect and the shields will absorb a little bit of your having to deal with bullshit. 
Oh, oh, oh. You wonder, what are you using there? Your movement isn't perfectly smooth. You're not using the keyboard, are you? Their key? Oh, hell no. Oh, but I am using the Xbox One controller. Phew! On PC, of course. Uh, alright. <sighs> We're here. We're here. Let's turn off things we don't need, or... The hell with that, I don't really care. We're probably fine. Um, got a whole bunch of fuel anyway. All right. So, uh, hang on here. Uh, one thing I do actually have to turn on is the vehicle hanger. That does come in handy. Uh, all right. And uh, let's take a look. Oops, sorry. Let's take a look around. Sorry, real quick, noob here. Before I get out of my ship. Ooh. There's the veil in the distance. With any luck, it might be rising over that uh, horizon as opposed to setting. Now I get to see more of it. Sorry for the jerky whatever doing this with the controller now. Now that's just pretty. We're going to take a nice picture of that. And... Oh, oh, come on. Oh, no, I went too long. Come on. Give me a moment there. All right. So I wanted to get the ground up nice and close. All right. And we got to get one with the ship. Where'd the ship go? Hey, ship. Well, here we are. And yeah, I guess, I suppose that's the mountain to climb there. Look at that. There's a star right at the, a little of a white star in the peak. Maybe that's our white dwarf, I think, maybe, where we entered the solar system at. Pretty bright, if I had a guess. Not really sure, though. Wow. Yeah, I see you're climbing the southern mountain over here, was it? I don't know if you want me to climb the mountain with the star. That's real nice. Um, hex my ship. All right, let me get... Uh, do me a favor. Let me give one more picture here. That's nice. I like that. All right. Which is the one with low fuel? Let's take this one. So. <laughs> Ruckus, for heaven's sake. Act like you've done this before. Yeah, thanks a lot. Leo Gravity warning. Yeah, 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 yeah. Awesome. Where you at? Where you at? Oh, there he is. There's Commander Noob. Ah. Wait, who's this over here? Why is there a... Oh, is that just my ship? Wait, I thought it was red or something before. Oh, whatever. Oop, oop, oop. Yep, definitely low gravity. That means we can fly over to... Hey, Noob, where are you going, man? You're going farther away. Or are you, like, falling down the mountain or something? Oh, sh oh, hello. How did that not damage us? Wow, that's cool. We got lucky. A eh, little structure. Nooblet, you're getting farther. Oh, wait. No, there you go. Oh, straight line. Stop moving away from me, dude. What are you doing? I suppose I should send my ship away and maybe it'll laugh the hell in it. Let's leave it there. I have a feeling it's going to go away that's in the None of two new blitz. Oh crap. 
Oh crap, not as much boost as I wanted. Oh, hey, not bad. Wow! Go SRV. place to park. Nice thing about watching my stream is you see how close to you I'm getting. Oh. Hey, you're going farther away from me. Noob. On the other side of that ridge? Oh no. It's gonna be forever before I get over there. Alright, first things first. Actually, I didn't like the lighting level we're at here, but uh. Okay, good. Our shit's gone. Alright, well, we're good. Alright, 85% structural integrity and new being a nooblet. Please tell me you're on this side of that gigantic. Making progress. It was five and a half. Now you're three. Almost there. Surprised we haven't run across any minerals. See a good amount of radar activity there. Don't see any minerals. Where's my fuel level, by the way? No, it's okay. There it is. 50% Damn it. Noob, you're going farther away again. Nope. You're climbing the other mountain. Oh, boy. Well, that's all good, man. I'll come over and climb this stuff with you. But you just got point two cam away from me, you bastard. Stop falling on your ass. Um, speaking of falling on your ass, yeah, yeah. How about that? I just ate some crow. Tastes pretty good. Num, 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 num. Oh, hey, here we go. 2.7. Yep, I'm going sideways. I don't think there's anything I can do about that until I hit the ground. There we go. Hey, less than 2 km. Uh oh. Oh, that's your ship. One point five KM for your little dude. Awesome. What do you uh did you did you damage yourself? <laughs> yeah, you're not far. One KM. Hopefully you guys don't hear all that beeping in the background. I'm gonna have to go AFK a moment. Okay, 
Look at that. Hey, where are you going? Hey. I did shoot you real quick. <laughs> no. Come back. I'm gonna make sure I'm not going to the wrong place though. Don't blow my ass off. Oh, uh, maybe. Well, if you're gonna do that, I'm gonna go climb. Um, well, this other mountain to the right, I suppose. Hold on one second, though. I will be right back. All right, and back. Where'd you go, noob? Oh, there you are, floating above. Eight cam away. Can't shoot you if you're up there. So you in the right place? We in the right place, noob? I think it's going to take a long while. Well, then you go on this mountain over here. Going to bed, breakfast, good night, thanks for watching. We'll be streaming probably for another 10 minutes. Let's see how far we can get up this mountain. Call it a night and help my ships up there in the morning. Hopefully, you're getting a good view. The streaming in 4K usually comes out very nice. A good way to test it if there's anyone else out there listening who wants to figure out what's a good, I don't know, a good method. Find a faint nebula to look at, essentially. Something that doesn't have a whole, you know, has has like, you know, maybe like some like reds or pinks or something like that, but there's just like like faded like uh, tones that don't really change much. Just subtle, subtle tones. And if they don't get blotchy, blocky, um, from one subtle tone to the next, you probably found a pretty good bandwidth to stream at. I'm doing a variable bit rate of 18 megabits per second. I record both record and stream in that quality, as it seems to be uh, right about on the money. Not exactly perfect. Maybe in super high detail if you're moving super fast. It could get a little patchy. Um, but just 99.5% of the time better. It seems to be just uh, sweet. And even by splotchy, I mean maybe like frame by frame. Together at 60 frames a second. Not 
be that splashy. All right, we're making pretty good progress over to this mountain here. Oh, oh, oh. Boom. We're supposed to be going up it, and then I think that's that white dwarf. You see that just to the left above that 20? There. See that little white side? I think that's the white dwarf, right? At the center of the system. I'm sure you can troll me in the comment section later if I'm wrong. No. Don't you when you ever join me in, you can play a little game stuff. And then, of course, that dwarf there. The dwarf, dwarf, sorry. The local star. See, in Elite Dangerous, you jump in on the star of. You jump in on the star of a system. But, like, some systems, more or less, you can have multiple solar systems in them. So you can have, you jump in on the main star of like an area, and maybe it has a whole bunch of planets, and hey, maybe it's some of them are habitable. But then there's this star way off in the distance, and then it's surrounded, of course, by its own planets, which may or may not be habitable, et cetera, et cetera. Or landable, or whatever. But unfortunately, then, you know, with be a lot of time to look to that other star. You can't hyperspace jump over to those different stars. They don't actually appear on the map like that. You only go to the main star of the system and then, you know, off you go from there. Alright, we are probably almost at the top here. Things are starting to somewhat level out. Oh. Alright, forty-six percent fuel and forty-six percent structure. But yeah, things are fairly leveled out here. Okay, there's Commander Noob with no hats. Let's come over here to take a better look at him, shall we? And you know what? If we uh, go out the car a bit, SRV car, whatever. It's not doesn't belong to Elon Musk yet. Uh, awesome launch, though, huh? How about that? Okay, so. There's another star there. Hey, maybe that's the door. Alright, uh, Noob. Noob, hi, Noob. Let's see what he's saying. Oh, no bed, just shenanigans. Good luck. Alright, Noob. Uh, land on this again, and the suffering begins anew. Ha 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 No hats. All right, well, you're going to do that up there. I don't think I'll be able to see you at all out of this, or at this perspective. But, you know it's fun? Driving. Driving like this is fun. So that's where we've been. We parked way down there. Came all the way up here. Our buddy's way up at the top of that mountain over there. Hi, no hats. Maybe you can see me shooting or something. Let's take our lavender wheels up this a little more. Boom, and that's what we look like floating. Needless to say, the stronger the gravity, the harder and more fuel it takes. The harder is because more fuel it takes. Oh, you know what? Ooh, we are not quite at the top of this things around here yet. Look at that. Gotta get up there. Ooh, things are looking a little jittery. going, keep going, keep going. Oh, see, still not quite on the top. And it may be that that's the real peak in the distance, or maybe this isn't even so much of a mountain as it is just up a gigantic ridge to bigger things. Oh, crap. No, maybe it is a dumb mountain. Alright, so let's see. Let's look around here. 
I don't think it's as high as, as Noob's Mountain. But looking around. Oh, come on. Quit doing that. Mm, it's clipping. Yeah, I know. It's stupid. All right, here we go. Your mountain's definitely taller, new. Well, it would seem we're at the peak of things here. I mean, you can go up... Well, I don't know. You can go up that way. Maybe it's pers false perspective. I mean, you can go up that way more. But, like... Yeah, no, it's just it. It's just it. It just goes up to bridges and more crap, doesn't it? Where are you, noob? I'm trying to see if any pixels are changing in the distance. Maybe one of them's yours. Nope, I don't think I see any pixels moving. Beautiful sights here. There's our veil. Let's get one with the SRV, shall we? We've got to take some pictures. Where the hell is it? Is it down here? Come on, where are you? Uh-oh. Where the hell's the car? Uh-oh. <laughs> 34%. Ah, yeah, I had a feeling I screwed something up. Or, or did I? Oh, there we go. Pretty, pretty. Oop, wrong button. Hang on, I gotta go up this stupid hill. Something about not being able to unbind reverse throttle with... Oh, come on. Seriously? With, uh... Um, with, with the... With the camera view? <laughs> this is just gonna do this nice and slow. There we go. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Right? Because it has to be perfect. And that's pretty perfect. All the way up there, noob. I don't think I'm going to be able to drive all that. I mean, I can, but I'm going to need some repairing. And as of right now, I need to go anyway. That will be all the streaming we have for tonight, folks. Noob, I'll catch up with you here on Discord in a little bit. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Uh, with any luck, I won't die here, and I can get back to the ship later. And thanks again, noob with no hats, for getting me down here and not having to, just, <laughs> having to spend like an extra half an hour just finding the way to spot. See you guys all soon. Thanks again for watching.